All right, guys, we're up at Sheep Mountain, our level three mountain course. And today we're gonna to talk about wind. When using Revic products, there's two ways to manage your wind solution, base wind and vector wind. In this scenario, I'm gonna cover base wind. Base wind was designed for quick hunting scenarios and targets out to 500 and in. It's treating a left to right wind the same as a right to left wind. And we know that spin drift, Coriolis, narrow jump do play a part, but when you're trying to get a solution quick or at targets that are these close ranges where those effects aren't coming into play yet, uh, this would be a great time to use base wind. At Gunworks, we're all about the perfect solution, the perfect wind solution, but sometimes the perfect solution is the fastest one. So I'm up on this mountainside, angled down at this coyote around 490 yards, and this is the perfect scenario where I gotta get something off quick and a distance where it's, it's forgiving and I don't need every factor inputted into my solution. I just need something quick. So I've already got my rifle set up. I'm gonna laze the coyote and it's just one push of the button. It's gonna give me a ballistic solution to dial up to and then it's gonna give me a base wind solution. My base wind is set at five mile an hour, which is a great base to be at because if it's 10 mile an hour, I'll double my wind hold. If it's two mile an hour, I'll cut my wind hold in half. But this is treating that wind left to right, the same as right to left. At this distance, with not much wind, this is the perfect scenario to do that. Blaze this target at 492, and a base wind of one minute. And since I'm feeling the wind on the left side of my face, I'm gonna hold left one minute. And that target's at 492, but because I have a ballistic rangefinder, it has my ballistics inputted. Based on that angle, I'm dialing up to 450. Left one minute. All right, just like that, guys, that's what base wind was designed for, quick and simple solutions. We had a coyote down here at 492 yards. I dialed up to 450 based on inclination, and then the base wind was one minute. I felt the wind on the left side of my face, so I held left that one minute, smoked the coyote. That's exactly what we're looking for. For longer range, more complex scenarios, heavier winds, and that's when we're gonna wanna use vector wind, and we'll cover that in another video.